Well, here we go then. This is our group two. Feature race one. The NetJets feature race one. Lined up nicely for the acceleration up to the big machine Vodka Spike Coolers. They start to spread out now. Side by side between Kazimitz and Jeff Brabham. Kazimitz gets the advantage. Brabham slots into second. That's Quadrachi there on the driver's left. Yep. Making that inside lane. Looking like he's fighting just right behind Matt Brabham. Matty Brabham in the all yellow slots into third. There he is in the number four. right behind his dad. Matt Brabham, in one year we've seen him race uh, Trans Am, Indy yeah. Lights, uh, those uh, stadium Stadiums, super trucks, trucks yep. just a little bit of everything. I think he did it the Gurr se series. Yeah. He'll jump in anything. He's a, he's a Brabham, that's for sure. He'll race whatever you like. And by the way, that goes back to the days of Sir Jack Brabham when Formula One drivers like Sir Jack would race Formula Two and occasionally even smaller cars. Yeah. Uh, and, and whatever they were thrown at, whatever was money for, that's why uh, America took off because drivers like uh, Jack Brabham would come over and race the Indy 500. And look at this, race. right where we left off last time. I know. Jeff Brabham takes over from Tonus Casamets. Tonus Casamets gets the draft right behind him. Joel Quadrachi there in fourth trying to get behind him, but Matt Brabham trying to pick which car to get behind. Into 12, side by side, and Matt's going to pick up the pieces if they get it wrong. Dad slots into second place. It's Brabham in second and third as they chase uh, Tonis Kazimets into the stadium section. Linus third, nothing between them. Coming up to 14 now. Matt Brabham goes Ooh. high and wide with a view to doing the switchback. Try and get as much drive as he can and maybe make just a little jolt into the inside there, a la Verstappen all those years ago. But he can't quite do it. You can see from above. He's got the momentum, though. Oh, yeah. They're glued together, the three of them pulling away, as we kind of expected, into 19 for the first time. Nothing between the top three. Matt Brabham we saw on new tires, so he may be waiting for those tires to warm up just a little bit more before he can really turn it on. But watch for Tonus and Jeff to go side by side into one here. Uh, here we go. Brabham slots out, and now it's side by side up the hill. Brabham's got the better line for now. He just needs to keep the car there, brake nice and smoothly, turn it in, and he. Kazimets has nowhere to go at that point. The 44 trying to stay with him. That's Joel Guadaraki in fourth position, and behind him, Bruce Hamilton in fifth. We're going to have to stay with these leaders, though. This race is just too good, Jonathan. We've got too many legends up here. Unbelievable as we see Quadrachi and Bruce Hamilton come through. But this is, I think we've already had, what, three, four lead changes up there for the battle for first? Yep, there's the BT-36. Bruce Hamilton coming through there in fourth position. But look at this battle at the front as... Matt Brabham looks as though he's jumped into second place now. Behind Kesemitz, and he yep. has. Uh, behind his dad, excuse me. Jeff Brabham yep. now leads from Matthew Brabham, and Kesemitz drops to third. What a race. He's gone from first to third in half a lap. Now it's going to be interesting to sort themselves out That's into 12. Travis Engen followed by Ron Hornick. That is the car Matthew Brabham was in last time, I believe. Yep. That's Ron Hornick, who's put this whole thing together for us, ladies and gentlemen. So, Ron, thank you for this. Brabham side by side, Jonathan. This is great. And Matthew Brabham says, hey, Dad, watch a little bit of this. <laughs> Through he goes and into the lead. Matthew Brabham leading his father, Jeff. And Jeff says, ha, son, yeah, not so quick. Oh, that's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Into the lead they go, and they are putting on a show in great equipment and showing us what it takes to be a great racing driver. Kesemitz, though, is not holding back, and he's going to be joining this fun, fun uh, combination of racing between the three of them. And Matt goes from first to third. I love it. Now he's gone hung out to dry a little bit. Now gains back second place. And ladies and gentlemen, last year, it was just the same thing, I think, two years ago when they did this. And they got out of the car and all agreed that was the most fun race they've yeah. ever had. And here they're doing it again. How cool is this? Really cool. Out of 20 then, down the main straight. Brabham Sr. leading the way from Brabham Jr. Here we go. Matthew Brabham jinx to the inside. Again, side by side as they come up to Big Machine Vodka. 
Spike Cooler's turn one. Matthew Brabham takes the lead. Kesemitz right there in third. Yeah, unbelievable here. You can really see how equally yoked they are as Brabham goes really far out wide on the curbs there. But I think the tires have kind of come to him as we see Joel Quadrachi and Bruce Hamilton. But we're back up here, and it looks like Tonus and Jeff now are the battle as Matt gaps them just a little bit. Yeah, just a little further back. Horning in a good battle with Travis Engin, who's having a busy day. Giraud is in ninth position, just ahead of Hanson in tenth. Then it's Crow, Flynn, Cowdery uh, just ahead of Tovo. Ethan and Jackson Tobo in those more modern cars. We haven't seen them yet, but uh, they're in those modern cars because we can't take our eyes off this great battle. Matthew Brabham leads them into 11. Now they'll sort themselves out in the run to 12 again. 